We're going to get back at it. We're going to finish up this job where we're trying to upgrade this system to a smart system. Trying is the wrong word. We're definitely doing it. Once I'm finished here, this is going to look beautiful. One of the other hangups from last week is we couldn't get the city water shut off because the curb stop out by the road was acting up on us. We just had the city out this morning. They got the water shut off. So now we're ready to cut out the system behind me so that we can install the valve manifolds that are sitting in the hole. Let's get that done. We did hit one snag on this job. Unfortunately, there's an extra valve supplying water to this house. Typically on every house, there is one pipe going to the house with a shutoff valve to it so that the homeowner can walk outside and shut off the water at that valve and not at the meter. So on this house that we're at, there happens to be two. And that's because the former plumber from years and years and nobody knows who he is, decided that he was just gonna stop using this connection on this side of the house and run a new pipe from the meter to the front of the house. Didn't tell anybody about it. The new homeowners get in here and don't know anything about this valve. So when somebody tried to turn on the water to the house, they opened up this valve here and flooded out the whole house. It was a total accident because nobody knew why this valve was here. This valve should have been abandoned way back when they updated the service. Unfortunately, that never happened. Fortunately for us and our client today, we've got Four Star Plumbing and Derek's out here to cap off that line for us so that nobody walks over here and opens up that valve and floods this poor man's house out again. So that problem is a non-issue now, thanks to Four Star Plumbing. All right, I gotta get back to my irrigation repair. There it goes, it's behind the house, it's over there. Oh, he's flying by. Here he comes. He's flying so low, you couldn't even see him come over the roofs there. Holy crap, that's loud. Hold on, they might be coming back. Or maybe not. All right, let's see. Sounds like he's coming right over my head. Oh, there he goes. If you've never tried moving a half a trash can full of dirt, I highly advise you try it. It's great for the back. And this is the finished product. We won't be cutting out the holes in the turf because the people who laid the turf down are more skilled at that than I am. So time is now design and build. We'll be doing that. We're going to put the finishing touches on this. They might have to bring some of that dirt down just a little bit, level all this out nice and pretty. But this is the finished product for the irrigation stuff with the exception of the power wire. Now that'll get connected to a extension cord around the corner, like I said earlier, until the kitchen gets built right here. And then from the electricity in that kitchen, we will go ahead and run a line up to the controller and then that'll have permanent power. But for now, the, the extension cord will do the trick. All right, all that's left to do is slap this back over where it was, clean up my little mess here and get on out of here.